Hi, my name is Ryan Verrett, and I'm a product manager at National Instruments. And today, I want to show you a brief demo of NI Flex Rio. NI Flex Rio consists of user programmable FPGA modules coupled to I.O. adapter modules. In this demo here, we have an NI Flex Rio FPGA module inside the chassis, and the adapter module is the NI6581, which is a high-speed digital module with rates up to 100 megahertz. Now, in this demo, uh, what we're doing is we're actually generating data out of the top connector here uh, and then reading it back on the bottom connector. The data that we're generating is actually a pseudo-random bit sequence that we're synthesizing on the FPGA. Uh, so we generate that data, and then we read the response data back, and then we have another pseudo-random number generator generating a phase-shifted uh, sequence of that same data, and we're doing a comparison. Uh, so we're actually doing this at 100 megahertz, so we're doing 100 million comparisons per second. Um, and as you can see, uh, we have zero bit errors, so the generated data is exactly the same as the received data. Now, if I click this button to inject errors, every now and then, uh, intentionally on the FPGA, we'll inject a bit error on the transmitted data. And when we go to perform the comparison on the received data, we'll actually realize that we had a bit error and uh, we'll actually accumulate a counter. In this case, in the time that I've been talking, uh, we've had 45 bit errors. So uh, 100 million times per second, we're performing that comparison, and 45 bit errors in you know, 10 seconds. Uh, so in addition to that, uh, we can actually add uh, additional features onto the FPGA. Uh, let's say you wanted to correct for those bit errors with uh, some sort of error correction. Uh, in this case, we can apply a Hamming code uh, which will uh, apply error correction, forward error correction, to the data that we're generating, uh, and then remove that Hamming code, uh, and actually then perform the, uh, the bit error rate comparison. And now, even though we're injecting errors, uh, we're not actually logging any bit errors, because the forward er error correction is effectively eliminating those, even though we're injecting errors um, after the error correction is applied on the, on the generation side. Uh, so this is just showing uh, a few different attributes of, of the NI Flex Rio technology, uh, the high-speed digital adapter module, uh, the ability to perform automated measurements, uh, digital measurements in this case, on the FPGA, and also uh, more complex things like the addition of digital protocols. Thank you very much.